I'm Dr. Lawrence Gray of Atlantic Plastic Surgery. When someone comes in to see me about facial surgery, I do not try and talk them into any specific procedure. I try and find out what it is that is bothering them and then figure out what surgery would be appropriate. Most patients have facelifts because they don't like the way they look in the mirror. I personally think the only reason to have a facelift is so you feel better about yourself. If you feel better about yourself, you'll probably present yourself in a more positive fashion. I decided to get a facelift because when I looked in the mirror, I saw years of stress to the point where I almost looked unrecognizable to my own self, and I wanted my face back. Dr. Gray gave me my face back, and he gave me my happiness back along with it. For the past five and a half years, I have been using the technique developed by Dr. Tonard and Verpale in Belgium, the MAX facelift, which stands for minimal access, referring to a short incision in cranial suspension. There is no cutting of tissues in the neck, and this has pretty much eliminated the risk of hematomas. For the most part, surgeons have been pulling loose tissues back towards the ear, whereas the best direction is pulling it vertically against gravity. Once I switched my technique to this type, I felt I got the best correction of necks that I ever had. And at least half of the scar before was made behind the ear, and these could be objectionable scars. Once you change your orientation and focus on pulling up you realize there is no need for an incision behind the ear. By having the incision go right at the hairline, we are able to avoid losing hair, which to me can be a telltale sign of a facelift. It's quicker for patients to have the surgery, and they look better quicker. Most patients are very presentable to go out in public within a week. The first time I took off the bandages and I looked in the mirror, I stared in amazement. I cannot tell you how happy I was with the work he had done and from there forward I have not had an unhappy day with his work.